A lot of us are trying to eat healthier, but you may have noticed a lot of healthy foods cost more. So News 8's Laura Hutchinson is going to help you stretch your dollar with how you can eat healthy without it costing you too much. It is all about shopping smarter, and Consumer Reports let us in on some shopping secrets that could change your habits. First, you want to keep healthy in perspective. Now, while organic is pesticide-free, it isn't necessarily nutritionally superior, so keep that in mind. You want to resist those healthy terms. For example, the term natural isn't regulated. So if you're paying more for an item that claims it's natural, you have to read the label and make sure that it, this is really a product that supports your health goals. You want to buy less or start freezing. Keep in mind how much food you throw away each week and change your routine so that you're not wasting resources. Start freezing some of those meals. Opt for produce that's in season. If you need something that's out of season, get it from the frozen food aisle. Frozen produce is usually just as nutritious as fresh and it will definitely save you some money. And this one is less about money and more about just being healthy. When you're choosing between products, you want to opt for the one with the fewer ingredients on the label that gives you more control over what you're eating. From there, there are some apps that you can keep on your smartphone that will help you save some money once you've chosen your healthy products. Ibotta and Grocery IQ are two very good ones that can help you save money. I'll also link you to some of our other grocery store money savers on WTNH.com. Helping you stretch your dollar, I'm Laura Hutchinson, News 8.